evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's intermission time. You now have ten minutes to stock up on the tasty treats offered at our refreshment stand. coming to our show tonight. We appreciate the opportunity to serve you. We think it's great to be able to enjoy fine entertainment in the comfort and privacy of your own car. The come as you are atmosphere is a pleasant way to relax in the evening. Don't you agree? You now have nine minutes. In the meantime, come and enjoy the many delicious treats at our refreshment stand. We've brought back those good old time flavors, and today they're better than ever. All these delicious treats are waiting for you at the refreshment stand. Delicious fresh popcorn, ice cold cola, and candy you know and love. They're all ready for you now, so you won't have to miss any of the feature. Come and get them. Eight minutes to visit the refreshment stand before the feature starts. Freshman stand. <laughs> to make your evening of entertainment more enjoyable, our refreshment stand has these delicious favorites hot and crispy pizzas. will start in six minutes. Still plenty of time to visit our refreshment stand. Observe the laws of your city, state, and nation. They exist to protect the rights and freedoms of everyone. starts, you still have five minutes to look over the menu before the feature starts. After the show, please replace the speaker on its stand. If after the show, please replace the speaker on its stand. If you accidentally break the cord, please turn the speaker in at the refreshment stand or the manager's office. Thank you. 
And by the way, on your way home, drive carefully. before the feature starts. America, my land, your land. But will it always remain America the Beautiful? Pollution, a threat to life and health. Not to mention one of our greatest natural resources, the scenic beauty of our land. Starting now, we must all pitch in to clean up our country before it's too late. America the Beautiful depends on you. Now, three minutes till showtime. Still time to visit our refreshment stand. Two minutes till showtime. your family and worship at the church of your choice this weekend. Now, only one minute till showtime. For your convenience, the refreshment stand will remain open during the show. Ladies and gentlemen, time for the show. Once again, thank you for coming to our theater tonight. Have an enjoyable evening. The refreshment stand will remain open for a short time. Still plenty of time to get a snack or cold drink. We'll make an announcement before the stand closes to give you plenty of time to get that last minute treat.
seen Charlie Barry? You're an interesting man, Mr. Varick. Last of the independents. Oh, my God. You want to die for somebody else's money? Half a million? Could be. Harold Young, Trace Cruz's bank manager, has estimated that the bandits escaped with less than $2,000. Who are they kidding? Known us? It's ten to one. This stuff belongs to the Mafia. This is gambling money skimmed off the top. The Mafia kills you. No trial, no judge. They never stop looking for you, not till you're dead. I'd rather have ten FBI's after me. One man against the Mafia. Bang! This little bank a million miles from nowhere gets hit by four professionals. Now they're gonna think that's strange. Why couldn't it be just a coincidence? Because they don't believe in coincidence. Crop dusters don't wave guns. Put that thing away fast. But we're gonna get them. I'll never get out of New Mexico. I feel that in my gut. Might want to fence off some money. Hot. Burning up. What do you want? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. Which doesn't mean I won't throw you right out that window if I have to. Sooner or later, you're gonna tell me everything you know. So why not save yourself a great deal of pain? Where's Charles Varick? When Charlie Varick runs out of dumb luck... He always has genius to fall back on. His name is Bishop. He's as methodical as a machine, as precise as a computer. Bishop is a mechanic. He specializes in body work. This one has to be done first. I'll handle it the way I always do. There may not be time enough for that. I'm not some wild Cleveland shooter. I don't cowboy. Hurry! On to the corner! Set up! I can't! <laughs> Bishop is a master of manufacturing death by accident and murder by natural causes. <laughs> For 20 years, his performance has been flawless, but then he made his first mistake. You ever hear the term mechanic used outside its normal meaning? Yeah. A hitman. So? So there we are. You've got a partner, Mr. Bishop. Bishop knows you build a killer from the ground up and teach him one cardinal rule. Remember, no second chances. Dead sure or dead. And when he's ready, you cut him loose. How long till she goes? Now. There's only one problem with teaching somebody to kill. He may become too good at it. Good enough to replace the teacher as the top mechanic. Are you Fuji, Fujiyama? Yes, I am. Who are you? I'm a cop.
real name is Joe Marshall. They call him Samurai. He speaks fluent Japanese. He got his martial arts training from the masters in Japan. He was brought over here from the police force in San Diego to fight us. Would you like to fuck me? You're the one that talked me into bringing this moron from San Diego to fight the uh, Japanese Katana Gang. Bingo. I want him dead. I want his head cut off and brought here. Have you been circumcised? Yeah, I have. Why? Well, your doctor must have cut a big portion of it off. I want his head on this piano so that every man in my organization understands once more that no Katana gets captured alive or talk. Got that? How did you know I'd come home with you? Let's just say, I can read eyes. I feel like somebody stuck a big club up my ass, and it hurts. I've got to figure out a way to get it out of there. <laughs>